City Skylines allows the user to create perfect landscapes and to create the most picturesque locations. Many would agree that beaches are one of the most beautiful places you can envision, instilling thoughts of serenity and enjoyment. So it makes sense that a large number of City Skylines creations feature stellar beaches. Here are 10 of the most beautiful beaches made within City Skylines. Would you like to win yourself a City Skylines DLC? I'm giving away three codes to three winners for any DLC of your choosing. To enter, simply head on over to bit.ly slash tmcitiesdlc and follow the instructions. Or click the link in the description. Little Town is a misnomer as the town is far from little. The large detailed town is an incredible build that has many areas worth exploring. Focusing specifically on the beach, Sanctum Gamer seamlessly blends the lush green woodland with a tan sand and blue ocean in a beautiful and believable manner. The beach feels like it wouldn't be out of place on the east coast of the USA. Waterfronts in Middle Eastern desert cities are almost always beautiful, but distinctly artificial and constructed. Silvara has managed to successfully recreate this as the high-rise skyscrapers and super yachts blend together to really bring the player to a city like Dubai. Next up is a stereotypical English seaside town, something very near and dear to me, so I really wanted to include this one on the list. You can see many of the regular attractions you'd find at any town along the English coast. Victorian era hotels, mini golf, and even a fun fair. Design Candy is by far one of the most creative and best articulated creators within the community. Palm Islands is a detailed tropical island build that really shows off some of the powerful terraforming tools that City Skylines has to offer. From this clip you can see how Design Candy has used the tools to mould the beaches of Palm Island.
Muscle Beach is a stretch of beach in Santa Monica, California. It's famed for being the breeding ground of bros. The area is heavily featured in Hollywood films and television shows. With an abundance of gym equipment, tennis courts and basketball hoops, it's not uncommon to see muscular men and women strutting their stuff on the beach. $2.20 really has brought this feel to city skylines with the Muscle Beach area of Springwood. Belvedere features something very American, skyscrapers on the beach. The juxtaposition of the dark greys, silvers and blacks of the built up city situated against the tropical blue seas and the colourful beach is a beautiful way of highlighting the beach in all of its glory. Rosenberg is a North European city that feels very German or Dutch. The Rosenberg beach differs quite heavily from the others on this list as it is not commercialised. Instead, it feels like a small private beach for the wealthy to launch their boats and yachts from. The pristine beach is very secluded and hidden away from view by lush shrubbery. In stark contrast to the last entry is Down Under. $2.20's attempt at recreating a beach from his native Australia, the Australian beach is massive and relatively barren. $2.20 has used props sparingly in comparison to more compact bills we've seen. But everything is put down feels like it has purpose. Down Under really does transport us to the Australian coastline. Emery Hills is a build from new creator Lijo, so go and check them out. Emery Hills is a strong industrial build that I initially featured due to its fantastic non-traditional beach style. The mountainous waterfront is beautiful and a great representation of many American coastal roads. However, since making this video, Lijo has posted screenshots of the underdevelopment waterfront and pier, which can be seen here in the screenshot. It looks fantastic. Prez was initially supposed to be my special guest this week, but unfortunately, due to time constraints, it did not work out, but expect to hear from Prez in a future episode. Calavera Beach is an effective and realistic build, 
blending beach and residential areas relatively seamlessly, Prez has managed to recreate the beach of a small, relatively low-income seaside town. If you have a project that hasn't been included on this list, or any of the previous episodes, then please do comment down below or drop me an email, and your suggestions might make it in next time. The series will return in two weeks with an episode on science fiction influenced cities. If you'd like to support me on Patreon, then please visit bit.ly slash tmyt patreon. My first three supporters will unlock a special perk by being able to select a theme for an upcoming cities, prison architect or planet coaster episode, or perhaps a different creative game altogether if that's what you'd like to see. Thanks for watching, until next time, bye!